The second aspect of privacy is for the individual is much more concerning to me because it is much more difficult to secure. I mentioned earlier that uh, in, in some cases appliances are showing up with microphones in them uh, or even cameras and perhaps good reasons. Nevertheless, these will eventually be used for ill will. We have applications that we choose to run on our smartphones that look at us and listen to us and can be viewed by anyone within the corporation that creates that application. And we have given them the right to do this by our acknowledgement that we agree to their terms and conditions without reading them in most cases. I myself seldom read these terms. There are too many, too many pages, and it takes too much time. And you probably find yourself in the same situation. This has to change. Or laws need to be enacted that certain things must be made very clear up front that if, for example, they're turning on the microphone or camera on your, on your phone, that you have the right to know that immediately before you even install the application. The, the need for privacy is something that it will require tremendous effort. We know that in America, the NSA, through its PRISM program, um, has coerced large corporations, Google and Yahoo among them, into providing information on citizenry. It has also tapped, without knowledge, the pathways between major data centers within Google and perhaps within other countries as well. This represents a grave danger to our security and our privacy.